NHL crew. They just did a hell of a job, and uh, the whole team, you know, to have uh, four players in the top six is just an amazing feat. Does it feel as good as you thought it would? No, it feels really good, especially to win it the way we did. I mean, right, I mean, it, you didn't know until the last 100 yards. I mean, that's, that's pretty exciting. That's what IndyCar racing is all about. You never can really plan it out, and there's no way to practice those last few laps. But uh, I was in good company there, running clean, clean, uh, you know, clean maneuvers with Elio and, and Marco. Um, and certainly, I thought he was going to be hard to beat, especially when he passed me that last time. Thought this might be it, but we got back by him and and just held on enough. That thank gosh, that straight, that uh, start finish is it's about 10 feet on this side. We pulled it off, and uh, like I said, I, I can't, couldn't have asked a to really win with a better group of people. This team has believed in me since the moment I got here, and uh, we've just got a great chemistry together. We won together. We won the biggest race in the world together now. Well, last year with TK passing you in that last restart, and then you get that red flag. What were you thinking during that red flag? I was thinking I'm going to make my car awfully wide here. This is going to be tough to get around me this time. And, uh, you know, those restarts really had me had me thinking to back to last year, so I did everything different that I could. I came off a three low and uh, came off a four low, and then the, the red flag threw us for a loop, but we had that uh, for the championship race in 2012. We had a red flag with about 10 laps to go, so I have a little bit of experience with it. Honda just did a great job today, though, giving me the power when I need it. American back in victory in Indianapolis. What's that say, man? You gotta be happy. I am absolutely thrilled, and uh, you know, I I always I always chased Indy cars. It's always been my dream. I grew up uh, watching the greats of the sport. You know, the Foyts, the Andrettis, the Unsers, Ray Hall. It's just. I, I grew up idolizing those guys, and, and now here I am coming down pit lane and, and the Indianapolis 500 winning car slapping M5. It's just surreal. When you won the championship two years ago, you said it's great, but my, my career's not complete. Yeah, absolutely. You, you wanted this win, right? Yeah, they always say, uh, you know, you can, you can get a championship, but if you don't have an Indy 500 win, it's really not a complete IndyCar career. It's certainly not complete now, but we have the two biggest boxes checked off, and we got a lot of work to do still. we got a championship to go out and win this season. Great experience with your family and your son there in Victory and on Yarder <laughs> Yeah. You know, I, I love that kid so much, and I love my family, my wife Becky, and uh, to see him in a DHL suit at the end of the race, priceless. I, I, I will never forget it, and um, got a great group of people to celebrate with tonight. Last question, I know your dad's a big part of your mom as well. What do you think your mom's thinking right now? I thought about my mom before that last restart. I thought, Mom, just got over me here, you know? Help me make the right decision. That's all I asked, and made the right decisions, and I thought about her on the cool-down lap, too, what, what she would, what you know, what would happen here, but... Um, wouldn't, wouldn't be able to uh, to be here without my dad supporting me through my whole career. Congratulations.